Welcome back to another video, my friends. Bobby Macy with SeeMyCampsite.com. And today, today we are at Dead Horse Point State Park near Moab, Utah. Just 25 miles from Moab, actually. And just a couple of miles from a national park that you may know as Canyonlands. What a fantastic place to recreate. But let's talk about Dead Horse Point for just a moment. Now, I am 2,000 feet above that beautiful horseshoe of a river down there called the Colorado. And it's weaving in and through these canyons, and it is beautiful. But this, this is actually just the viewing area. There are cliffs all around, and while there are nice stone barriers and designated viewing points, there's also a lot of exploration that can happen. So if you bring your family here, make sure to keep an eye on those kiddos. The other nice thing is that you can actually bring your pets to Dead Horse Point State Park. They can camp with you. They can walk along the trails. In this surrounding area, we have two campgrounds with a total of 56 sites. And don't worry, as per usual, we'll show you those. But until then, You've also got nine yurts, show you those. You've got eight miles of hiking on foot that is just glorious with incredible views. Now, when I say incredible, I don't say that lightly. I'm talking about magnificent views. You're seeing just a glimpse of this right now. The air is fresh, it's free of pollution. There's not a lot of noise. This is a quiet place. In fact, at night, this is a dark sky approved viewing area for the stars. Now, if you don't know what that is, Google it. It's incredible. You can see the stars here and in a few surrounding areas like you wouldn't believe. Absolutely phenomenal. Aside from the hiking and the viewing, you can also mountain bike. If you don't have your own bikes, you can rent them here, but on top of that, we're talking about a 14.7 mile loop with astronomical views. Now, I keep talking about the views, but that's what Dead Horse Point State Park is all about. It's all about the views, the red rock, the high cliffs, the low canyons. It's incredible and some beautiful water features. So we got mountain biking, we got camping, we got hiking, we got the pets. This is a great place for photography, both during the day and at night. And really, Dead Horse Point State Park is a great middle ground and base camp for what you want to do in Moab in general. Now, in just a minute here, we're actually gonna show you those campsites and go over there. But a few things you ought to know. You're not gonna find a lot of running water around here. That's because the water has to be brought in with trucks from Moab. So every drop is extremely valuable. Now you will have flushing toilets and you'll be able to wash your hands, but you're not gonna have showers at the campgrounds or anywhere near the actual visitor center of the state park itself. The visitor center is equipped with some snacks that you can buy, you know, in case you're just road tripping here or passing through. It's also equipped with memorabilia, swag, and some souvenir options for you. The other thing we need to discuss is this. What is cell reception like here? Right now, I have one bar and it's not even LTE. And that's at the actual viewing area amidst the Red Rock Cliffs. Now at the visitor center, I was able to get three bars LTE on Verizon. The other service carriers and service providers are not nearly as good in this area. And that's not a shot to them. It's just the way that the towers are set up around here Verizon signal comes in best, but don't plan on streaming Netflix while you're camping unless you have some sort of hotspot that is better than what your cell phone would provide. We always want you to know what to expect because it is important anytime you are camping that people know where you are and what you're up to for safety reasons. All right, ready for some more fun? Follow me over to the campgrounds, the 56 sites between the two campgrounds and you may just find a spot that you really like. Let's go.
there you have it, my friends. We hope that you enjoyed this review of Dead Horse Point State Park here in Moab, Utah. Please do not forget to subscribe. Hit that bell icon so that you are notified when we drop new videos. And we will see you in the next video.